Hello everybody, welcome back. You see me again in the same stuff, my hippie outfit. There, the air conditioner just went off. I won't be so freezing down here. And it's I just went upstairs. I don't see the weather or anything down here. So I just looked outside, it's really windy. So we're probably gonna get some rain. But anyway, I look lovely. Thanks for coming. And um, I'm Laura, Tiny Toes Reborn Nursery. See, Laura, in case I forget my name. I forget a lot of other stuff, but I don't think I'll forget my name. We've got Mr. Grayson right there. We, I just did the video of his backpack, um, his diaper bag for him. And I've been promising you a video with my new carriage. And I got this, what? It was a Christmas present, I think, to myself for the nursery. I, um, instead of buying another doll back then, I got us a new car. I have a the green carriage, and it's just a stroller. This is a carriage that can be a stroller. So I think I did a pretty good uh, box opening of it, but I will. I think you can see this. May have to come a little bit close. I want you to be able to see the whole thing. So it's got huge wheels on it. I love the wheels. I have not taken it outside yet. It's still brand new. See, the front of it has like a little um, thing for, to put their feet when they get bigger. My babies are not going to get bigger. They are not going to get bigger. So, and it has a play compartment down there. I can put stuff. Now, because my diaper bag... This diaper bag does not have the straps to hook on to here because it's supposed to have straps that you can hook on right here. Um, this strap, I've made it as low as it can go. I can do this. It will, if it slides down a little bit, it's going to be um, too much. Um, I'm not sure what, I, if this is for it to lock when you fold it up over here, there's a little, but I can put it like right here, but it's going to be in the way of me seeing the baby. So I'll probably end up just putting it down under, down under here. So let's put it down under here all the straps in there it'll just make it a pain in the butt when you have to get it out but it's down there I put it down there okay and I'll have to take it out when I um, um, go outside and it's got straps and stuff all over the place it's uh, the little the little stickers on it are coming undone because it's cold down here and the little stickers on the side are coming off. That's funny. I can hop blow it on there. But this is the, I think it's the no-name brand of whatever this brand is. I don't know. But this is what it looks like. You can unzipper it right here to take the hood off. Um, I'm not going to unzipper it. I have a little peaky pouch right here. So if you take this, um, how do you switch it over? Oh, you can't. You can switch the whole thing and turn it over. This white button and the white button on this side, if you hold them in, this whole thing comes out like a bassinet. But I don't want to take it out. I don't want to flip it around. So I won't use the peeky boo part. Um, this is an extra coverage one so the sun doesn't get in their face. Um, put that all the way down. Make it look nice. Okay. So all the way down looks like that. I can take this part off. 
um, it just comes out of the little snappy thing here. And I got nails on, so I can't do I can't do it. But if you take this off, you push these white buttons in, you can you can take this whole thing out. It's a handle. I'm not going to take the handle off, but I will. Um, I did kind of unzip it. Okay. This comes off. It's, it just zips on, but it keeps the baby in there. And I don't want to take it off, but I will move it over so we can see what's on the inside. It came with this little soft thing. Um, the straps go through here. Um, not quite sure how it comes apart. I will figure it out. Hmm. It should come apart so you can put it through these holes. This hole, well, you can't see it. Sorry. This little hole, see the holes? And so this can go down through here and this should come off I don't know why it's not coming out it should come out all right I am not quite sure how uh, my book is not near me so I have to figure out how this comes off because you should be able to put this part through here and this part through here and it hooks to here like that so but I'm not gonna I mean when I go for my walk I'm not going to I'm gonna have to figure out how that comes undone I would think that it would just come unsnapped I'm gonna have to look at my book to see how to take that off so I can get it in here right so it's in the right way there's a trick to it and there was a couple of things like that on here but this is what the stroller looks like let me move my chair because it's in the way so you can lock the wheels so they don't swivel I'm not going to do that but we are I've got a little cup holder here for uh, me for my drink or a bottle for him or her, whatever. This little button up here, you push this and you push this and it folds down. Really easy, really comes apart easy. So you can, um, you can really, you're supposed to be able to switch it. This one you can't, you have to switch the whole thing. So I want to see the baby, but if you didn't want to have to look at the baby, you could, take this off, turn it, and this is up this way. You can turn it around, then it's like a stroller for an older child. So, and it has little breather things here. You can, um, there's little breather things. They come on um, Velcroed right there. And there's a spot here where you can tighten this up. So you can lift it. So it's like a, um, so it's like a stroller, you know, I can push it up like that all the way and tighten it behind here, which I don't want to do, but you can. And there's a little pouch back here, but if you, ha you know, if you wanted to put your baby, so it was like a stroller, you could do that. I'm not going to do that. I want them to lay down. So we will loosen this back up. So it lays down there. And I want to be able to see the baby. So I do have to look at the book. Now I am going to put in here... Okay, 
These things, like for your car seat, you can put in here. So, this is going to be kind of a long video, guys, because I don't know what I'm doing. And that's par for me, you know. So, put that there. This goes up. And then this will go, you know, underneath the arms like this. I gotta uh, adjust it for the, the baby. So it's gonna look like that. It's so cute. It says summer on here. And then you put your blankets and whatever else you want in here. You can, if you have another baby head thing, you can put that on here. Um, this, this Velcro's on. We're gonna fix that because it's like coming undone. So I'll have to look at my book to rearrange that. But this is the stroller. We've got it, the bag in there. Now, it's way heavy with the bag in there. And with my back, I'm not attempting to take it upstairs. I'll take the bag out and take this upstairs and then bring the baby. And But this you can have halfway or all the way, a little bit of the way. I'll probably have it a little bit of the way so I can see them. Now you can lay this down. Um, let me see if I can remember. Yeah, you can lay it down. So I'll probably have it laid down so I can keep an eye on him in here. So if I have it all the way covered now, I can still see. And I thought this adjusted because I can have it high up because it's high up or I can um, um, move it down or up. And I can't remember how to do that. I thought, oh, well maybe I can't on this one. I thought I could. I'll have to look at the book again because I thought I could adjust it. Or uh, maybe it's my other one that I can adjust it. It don't matter. But this has leather on here, so you're not going to, because this is like metal and it'll burn your hands. So it has these little grippies on. And it is so cute. I can't wait to go for a walk with them. So anyway, guys, I think that is it. This is a stroller. I did put in his thing. We've got it set up for him. I just have to adjust the belts and I'll find my book. I think it's over here to adjust it for him. And when we get back from camping, we will go for a walk and I'll show you my area down here, my, my scenery. Um, let's just so that you can see, I do have a bug net that I can put on. I have a bug net. And that will go down here. But I want you to see what he looks like in here. Come here, buddy. Hey, come here. Oh, he's so cute. A little bombs. He's all curled up, guys. So we will put him in here where he should go. I'll put his legs down. I have him up right now. That seems like it's going down. But he's little inside there. See how little he is inside there? Look at how little. And we will put his, I can actually put his bag up here if I wanted to. But um, I don't live where there's a lot of people. So my road's pretty quiet. This snaps up there like that. So nobody will see. You see, you can't even see him. Unless, and then you have this down. You can't see him at all in here. So those of you that have Reborns and you want to take your Reborns out with you and all that, this is a good, this is a good carriage. I mean, you have to save up for it. I got lucky and found a deal. And, you know, the you can't see 
you know, if somebody, if you're walking and somebody says, oh, can I see your baby? You can pull it back a little bit, you know, obviously make them so that they're um, posable, you know, make sure that they're, they're po um, real looking. And that's what we'll do with the next video when I get back is we'll get him posable so he looks real and all of that and get his blanket in here. And because it is hot out, I'll probably um, put his little side panels up so there can be air coming through. And the same here, I'll put this up so air can come through when it's up. Although you can't see under here. When it's up all the way, you can see, so you can kind of see light and um, all of that. But if you don't like this thing, you can take this off. But I'm going to leave it on because it attaches to this. And, you know, if you don't want bugs in him. So I'm going to leave him in this. Leave it parked right here because I'm good. <laughs> you know, until I get back. And then I will have it all set up. We will finish setting it up. Um, get it ready for him to go on our walk. We'll go on our walk. And preferably, I'm either going to do it in the early morning or later in the afternoon because I'm not going to go in the high heat. Not happening. But we'll go for a walk. So that is coming, guys. I promise. It'll be before the end of the month. This is June. So today is June um, 6th. It's actually my daughter's birthday. She is 36 years old today. I don't think she watches my videos, but if she does, happy birthday, Sash. Love you to pieces, and uh, yeah, I don't think any of my kids watch my videos because they think mom's weird <laughs> because of the dolls. My friends do, though. I have a couple of friends that watch. Hi, guys. And um, so thanks for watching Ramblin'. It's time to go. When you get Ramblin', it's done. All right, we'll see you all again soon. Bye now.